Okay, so in today's Roblox One Piece game video, we're actually going to be going from noob to the one and only Marco the Phoenix. And these noob pro videos do take a really long time to make, so please consider subscribing. And anyways, to actually become Marco in One Piece game on Roblox, we're actually going to have to complete a bunch of steps. And it's actually one step that you guys, yep, you right there sitting watching this video, you guys have to complete a step as well. And that's real quick. Hit that like button and subscribe. Let's try to get like 3,000 likes, 2,000 likes on this video so anyways let's just get right into the steps all right so now let's get into the steps so basically it doesn't matter what order we complete any of the steps and we just have to complete them all by the end of the video to become marco the phoenix so let's just move on to step one so step one is to actually get marco's devil fruit because if you guys don't know in the anime and this game marco did actually eat the phoenix fruit and phoenix fruit is actually a legendary fruit meaning it's actually um super rare but it's also super overpowered so we're actually gonna have to grind for a ton of cash like a ton of cash because this thing is pretty rare then just keep spinning at the merchant till we get the phoenix fruit and yeah now let's actually move on to step two so step two is to actually get hockey because marco does have some pretty strong hockey so after getting hockey we're also gonna have to level our hockey stat up a ton because you know, every like, I'm sure it's like 100 levels, your observation hockey does last half a second longer. So, we're gonna need to have some pretty strong hockey. Now, let's actually move on to step three. So, step three is to act, uh, step three might actually be the hardest step in this entire video. This might take us really, really long, but basically, we're actually gonna have to kill Marco a ton of times because after you kill Marco the Phoenix once in a Roblox, uh, in a one piece game on Roblox, Basically, there's like a 5% chance for that. I'm not even sure of the exact chance, but there's a small chance that he actually does drop a Phoenix V2 scroll. And basically what happens is, when you pick up the scroll and use it, your Phoenix will actually basically become a different version. And you can actually go into the full form of the Phoenix. So, Phoenix V2, you've got to get it using the Phoenix scroll, which is actually a drop from Marco. So, it's going to be really hard to do, but Phoenix V2 is super overpowered. So, we're going to have to get that. And now, the final step in this video is to actually kill Luffy. Yep, you heard me right. So once we get Phoenix V2 hockey and all of the steps, right? Once we're super overpowered and literally Marco, we're actually gonna have to defeat Luffy by going to his island and fighting. So I feel like that's enough stuff uh, steps for now. We can make it some more along the way. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy and let's just get right into the video. Alright, so here we are in a one piece game on Roblox and I'm actually gonna be doing this on my main account because it's actually really hard to do, Marco does have a ton of HP, so let's actually start off by spending for the Phoenix Fruit at low time because they do have a ton of spare cash, so let's go. Okay, we're here at the Merchant and let's just start spending, and if you guys are wondering how I have so much cash, basically I did do some quests before the video because, uh, yeah, I knew that we're gonna need a ton of cash for the Phoenix Fruit, and okay, first fruit we got is the Fire Fruit, so... It's not too bad, but uh, you know, the fire fruit's not really that good. It's not what we want to go. Here we go, another spin, and okay, we only have around uh, one spin left, so that's kind of unfortunate, though, no way, we just got the worst fruit in the game, dude, the invisible fruit, that's actually um pretty sad, though, here we go, next spin, bro, just please give me the phoenix fruit, come on, please, game, just give me the phoenix fruit, and we got the bend fruit again, so, I don't, I don't get it, man, we're super lucky, but unlucky at the same time, we keep, keep getting good fruits that we don't need, man, though, for now, let's actually go and grind and farm Marco because basically he does give some pretty good cash. And also, while we're grinding cash from him, we can also, you know, maybe get the Phoenix V2 scroll early on. Though, so yeah, let's head over there to grind cash for some more fruit spins. Alright, so we are at Phoenix Nest Island where actually Marco does actually reside. So here we go, quest dummy 16, and let's just start farming Marco.
Okay, so we now have 100 million cash. So let's actually head over back to Logue Town and start spinning for the Phoenix Fruit. Okay, so here we are, Logue Town, and so actually go ahead and try to spin for the Phoenix Fruit. So here we go. Let's uh, roll for the merchant. Hopefully, we do get the Phoenix Fruit. Please be the Phoenix Fruit, and let's see. Holy B and okay, bro, we, we really just got the invisible fruit. Like, dude, why do we keep getting the invisible fruit? Like, that's literally the worst fruit in the game, though. Second spin, please be the Phoenix fruit, please. And we just got the barrier fruit. Okay, so this is the third spin now we're gonna do right now, and hopefully, this is the Phoenix fruit. Uh, because yeah, this is our third spin or our second last spin, whatever you guys want to call it. Though, here we go. Let's see, and Okay, another ice fruit. So let's see how many ice fruits do we have. So we have one, two, three, and wait, where's the fourth one? Yep. So so far we've gotten four ice fruits to do. Real quick, before the final spin, please hit the like button and subscribe so that you know I get some extra luck. And hopefully this is the Phoenix fruit. Let's see. And will it be the Phoenix fruit? Let's see. And close my eyes and let me open them. Let's check our inventory in a second. Let's see. And okay. I think it's safe to open my eyes and let's see open my eyes and okay what fruit did we get okay i don't see any phoenix fruit here i'll just go check the recording later of what we actually got though we still never got the phoenix fruit that's pretty sad so let's just keep grinding No way guys, no way, we just hit 57 million cash, but one what's even crazier, I just respawned after killing Mark, I was a little confused, right, but I checked my inventory and look what we got, the Phoenix Scroll, so I'm not going to do anything with it now because I'm afraid if I actually like click or something by accident right now, it might disappear and you know, not that it'll just go to waste, so what we're actually going to uh, do real quick is, we're actually going to head over to Logue Town and uh, basically just spin for Phoenix Fruit again. And yeah, hopefully we're able to get it. Then we can do the scroll and hopefully get Phoenix V2. So let's go. Okay, here we are. Long time, let me just set my spawn. So here we go. We're gonna spin for the Phoenix route. I mean, hopefully we get it in these two spins. Come on, just like and subscribe if you guys haven't already. Uh, though, here we go. Please. Just give us the phoenix fruit game please hopefully we get the phoenix fruit let's see and okay what the berry fruit but okay it's okay it's all good guys we still have one more spin so here we go merchant blah 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 yes blah 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 and let's see will we get the phoenix fruit please be the phoenix fruit and okay we'll bro how many ice fruits are we gonna get dude we just got like pretty sure we've gotten like six or five ice fruits so far in this video which is you know pretty insane though anyways for now, I'm just going to continue grinding and yeah, I'll see you guys when I'm at like a uh, hundred million cash. But this time I'm actually going to start grinding at uh, that smoker island right there because I'm pretty sure that does give a lot more cash. So yeah. Okay, so here we are at the island. So let's just start grinding for some cash so that we can spend some more time for the Phoenix fruit. Okay, so we finally have a hundred million cash after just a ton of grinding. So let's head over to Logue Town and start spinning. Alright, so here we are, Logue Town. So let's just start spinning and look at all of these fruits we have by now. Like 
after so much spinning, we still haven't gotten Phoenix fruit, but we've still like, we've gotten so many fruits, but none of them have been a Phoenix fruit. So here we go, another spin, and please be the Phoenix fruit. Let's see, and let's go, dude. After so many spins, look at this: one, two, three. Let's just uh, console three, six, nine, twelve. I don't know. I'm counting wrong. I think thirteen, fifteen. I don't know. Let's say we spun around like twenty-ish times, bro. Twenty spins, and we finally got the Phoenix fruit. I mean. You know the phoenix fruit is a legendary fruit but i expected that we'd you know get it a lot sooner but anyways it's all right we just got it so let's actually remove our string fruit right now which is uh, actually going to be pretty sad because the string fruit is actually pretty good but here we go let's remove it and blah 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 yes belly boom let's remove the fruit and time to eat the phoenix fruit so here we go i really like the model for the phoenix fruit actually it looks pretty sick i like i actually like like i love little glowing parts on it it's really cool and here we go we just ate it and let's see what can happen so here we go we just got the phoenix fruit so let's check out its first move bursting phoenix wait what why don't it work okay i think we have to wait for our uh you know the little um thing because i don't know why you can't use moves as soon as you spawn okay though that was a decent move here we go phoenix light okay so phoenix it, I, i'm gonna be honest it really doesn't look that good like it looks like compared to other games it doesn't really look that good but it's okay guys we still have to see how Phoenix V2 looks. So here we go. Phoenix Pearl 3. Boom. Collect it. Let's see what's going to happen. Here we go. And yup, our moves have changed. Here we go. First move. Ow, Notori or whatever it's called. Okay. That looks a lot nicer now. Next move. Pineapple Snow. Bro, that move looks sick, dude. Honestly, I feel like Phoenix V2 in this game might actually be one of the better Phoenixes of all One Piece games on Robux. Next move. Healing Flames, okay. Yeah, that's just a healing move. Pretty sick. Next move, Hybrid. Ooh, they have like a whole hybrid form that you can uh, kind of stay in without, you know, exiting it or anything. Like, you can fly around to it. It's pretty cool. We go Pineapple Stone with the hybrid form. Pretty cool. Let's get into the hybrid form. And let's actually enter the full form. So, we saw the hybrid form. It's time for the full form. So, here we go. V. And, wait, what? Nothing happened. Oh, no, this dude's actually trying to kill us. Let's use our observation axe. Here we go. V. Wait, no, it's not V, I'm using the wrong key. It's T, it's supposed to be T. Okay, we're dying, we're dying. Oh no, this dude's trying to kill us, bro, bro. Chill out, here we go. Full form, we just escaped with the full form. Okay, this looks sick, dude. Healing flames, take. Oh, that's a little OP. Do you just see how quickly we're healing, dude? Look at this, man, this looks insane. I can't actually see its face because uh, it keeps pointing away from me. This weird, let's just try to look at its face. And okay, whatever. It looks pretty sick, man, this is honestly a really really cool looking uh, phoenix model here we go pineapple stone pretty cool i don't know Toriel's pretty cool and yeah honestly this might be one of the better phoenix fruits in like of almost every one piece game so yeah pretty cool all right so now that we've gotten phoenix v2 and hockey because i already got hockey like, a while back even before this video and you know we've gotten everything we've completed all the steps except one step we still need to defeat Luffy, so let's just head over to Luffy, and I'll see you guys when I'm on his island. Okay, so here we are at Luffy's island, so let's actually just get his quest, then yeah, we'll start off by, you know, trying to kill him, and this is actually also a good opportunity to actually see how much damage this new Phoenix V2 does, so it's actually, uh, you know, here we go, let's turn our hockey, and or Diablo Jambe or however you pronounce it though. Here we go. Full form. Let's start off with Al Notori or whatever it's pronounced. And okay, that's some big damage, dude. It's actually some insane damage. And okay, I accidentally uh kind of got on my form. Here we go. We're gonna shield just like that. It's just that simple, dude. This game's just so easy with the Phoenix fruit, dude. Like this fruit is actually insane, man. And here we go. The one thing I've noticed is it doesn't really like I mean it has two attack moves, but that's it. Like, just two attack moves no more than two so i guess that can kind of be a problem sometimes you know depending on uh you because if you don't like like if you're trying to attack a lot right then it might be a little you know problematic for you to we'll go let's check out his hp so he's about to die he has around half of his hp left which is um you know pretty good for like considering that you know it's only been around like 30 seconds since this fight started but yeah, once again, my only problem with this fruit is it only has two attack moves, but, you know, it's fine, it's good. And, okay, he actually did just kill us, which is kind of unfortunate, but it's whatever. So, here we go, our second attempt, although we did die, but 
who cares we go boom get him with that nice and pineapple stone that also did some nice damage let's just heal up so i feel like like the two moves that this fruit does actually have they actually might be some of the highest damaging moves in the entire game because like i've noticed they do do a pretty insane amount of damage so yeah and they go just like that he's dead like that quickly dude and that's actually pretty insane because Luffy does actually have a ton of HP and the fact that we just killed him so quickly is, uh, you know, pretty cool. So anyways, we just completed all of the steps and yeah, that's going to be it for this video and hope you guys enjoyed. This was really, really fun to make and yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching this video. Drop a like and sub and comment below who I should become next in One Piece game on Roblox. So yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching and see you guys in the next video.